Welcome back. Our next guest here, Nikki Sanders, is the founder of Taffy's Touch Senior Dog Rescue, and she has brought along this adoptable little gentleman, <laughs> Odie. What's up, Odie? How you doing, bud? Look at that sweet face. Hi, Nikki. Hi. Good to have you here. Can oh. you talk to us about Odie? Like, he's a very, he's a very special pup. He's a very special pup. Um, he actually had a pretty rough life before coming to us. He yeah. was admittedly a man Cold. Have a really botched up job. I'm not sure what happened to his poor little ears, oh, and his God. bottom jaw has been broken. Oh gosh. So, but he's he's a lover. He just trusted yeah. me within 15 minutes of having him. So sweet. Yes. Is he a, is he a dachshund? What is he? He's a dachshund chihuahua mix. Okay. Is what the shelter had him as. Um, <laughs> he's just the sweetest little guy. A toothless 13 yeah. year old. Dachshund Such Chihuahua, that's right. Hard, who's so. ready to love you. <laughs> I know, somebody get this guy a oh home. Gosh, I love weird. the thing about Taffy's is it is specific to senior dogs because there's a need for that. Can you speak sure. to that a little bit? Yeah, so we usually have about 20 to 25 of our dogs in our care that remain in the rescue for the duration of their life. They're not mm -hmm. adoptable because they have chronic health concerns. Mm -hmm. um, so we handle that. We get all their vetting. We continue the medications for life until we notice that they're really uncomfortable or in pain. Yeah. And then we also have usually 10 to 20 adoptable dogs like Odie here. He will see our vet next week, so Aww. we'll learn a lot more. Um, but we also provide their medical care until they're adopted. Yeah. How does a pup like Odie, if he doesn't have any teeth, how does he eat? I imagine this he needs some extra TLC. You know what? I thought that before I got him, yeah. but he just scoops it right up. Mealtime is his favorite time. It's okay. like Christmas morning. Every <laughs> yeah. time that I put down his food, it's soft food, obviously. Yeah. yeah. Um, but he just scoops it right up and just wolfs it down. Yeah. Like he's got no issue. So I think he's just gotten used to it. There's nothing going to hold him back. Yeah. That's right. Yeah. That's right. He oh, seems to be a one person dog. Okay. Kind yes. Of. Yeah. Um, his ideal home would be somebody that's home most of the time. Yeah. I don't know, like maybe an elderly owner that's yeah. home a lot um, he he gets a little guard dog mentality okay <laughs> yes with, with his one person um, so if you were to reach out and try to touch me or hit me or something not that you would but if sure. you were to try he would probably come after you pretty quick fiercely so, protected so yes. chivalry is still alive I exactly that's right. That's right. I know that's right <laughs> Nikki warned us right before we came back to you guys from commercial yeah. and we of course normally when the dog is here we're petting them we're petting them yeah. but we want to respect the fact that you know he's protective of you yeah. yes. and whoever his owner may be that's right. awesome right yeah what's your greatest need now as an organization you know like I said we cover all those vet bills for yeah. 30 plus Plus dogs constantly monetary donations will forever be our biggest need um, outside of that we provide beds and food to our foster homes yep. crates if needed things like that um, are always in demand flea and tick prevention is a huge need so yeah and, and if you can't adopt let's talk about fostering because mm -hmm. that could be a really good yes. option for some folks most definitely so fostering like I said we provide the vet bills a lot yeah. of people want a dog but financially, maybe they struggle, especially with seniors like Odie, they can be expensive. Sure. So just fostering allows you to have that companionship while we cover the vet bills. That's wonderful. Well, oh, sweetie. And, and people can follow along with you on social and they can also join your newsletter. Is that correct? Yes, we Yo. do have a newsletter and the link to that is on our website. Okay, great. Mm -hmm. Taffy'sTouchRescue.com is where you can learn more to learn more or maybe even adopt today, little Odie over here or mm -hmm. some of the other pets that Nikki has there at Taffy's Touch. Thank you so much for bringing him along. Oh, good, yeah. Thank I hope you he finds a home. I think no. he will. Yeah. yeah. Me too, yes. Yeah. Someone please adopt <laughs> Odie. All the information up there on the screen for you right now. Taffy's Touch, and then we've got their email there as well. Thank yeah. you, Nikki. Thanks, Thanks Nikki. You. Thank you very so much. much. Well, still to come, we are celebrating National Donut Day just a bit early with our friends from Jack's Donuts. We're going to ask them about their partnership they have as well with the Salvation Army. Yeah, stick around, friends. We'll be right back with Morning Now in just a couple minutes. Good job, Odie. Way to go, bud.